Okay, pupils, we are on this year five English plus one book book. We are on page 12. We are on unit one, towns and cities. Vocabulary, places in a town or city. So let's take a look at activity one. Look at the pictures. Correct the words. So number one. So this one is monument. And then this is number one. So number one, market. So this is wrong. And the correct answer is library. So you may copy here, library, and then you strike to this word here. And number two, cinema, which is wrong. So this is train. So this is train station. And number three, parked. So this should be market. M A R K E T. And number four, train station. So this one is bridge. B R I D G E. So this one. And then number five, monument. So this is cinema. Library. So this is bus station. And number seven, bus station. So this should be parked. So next we go to activity two. Read the clues and write the places. So given example here. So maybe I maximize it a bit. Okay, number one. So let's take a look at example first. If you are interested in new clothes, this is a good place for you. So shop. And then number one. There are desks, desks, boards, and a lot of students here. So obviously this is school. So S C H O O L. Next, we have number two. This place has got tables, chairs, and a good coffee too. So this is, so if you take a look at this coffee, so this is cafe. And then number three. There are good actors here. So this is theater. So T H E A T R E. Theater. Number four. These are people's home. There are a lot of these in one building. So we have this building. So this is flats. F L A T S flats. And number five. This is a road in a town. There are cars and buses here, and houses too. So we have this one street. So flats we already fill in the blank, and we have street. 
and number six. This is a good place for people interested in basketball. So this is regarding sports center. So we have this S P O R T center. And number seven, there are different shops here. So we have this shopping center. So this is British English, so don't write as C-E-N-T-E-R, so which is American English. And we have this number eight, people work here. There are a lot of computers and desks. So this is office building. Next, we take a look at activity three. Look at the map, right? Find more sentences about things you can see. So there's a cafe. So this is an example. So number one. So we have this bridge here. So we follow the format. There's a bridge. And then number two, we have this market here. So there's a market. And number three, we have this shop, shop here. So there's a shop. And then number four, so we have this park here, or call the square. So there's a park. And number five, so we have this, this is called hotel. So there's a hotel. So if you take a look, we have a bed here. So there's a hotel. Okay, maybe just now you didn't see it clearly. So I already refocus the camera for you. So this is the sentences. And then finally we go to Number four, so which is the hardest in this page. So write sentences about the capital city of your country or a big city near you. So I'm living in Malaysia. So later I will show you some example and sentences for you. So there's a big new office building. It's opposite the station. So if you are living in Kuala Lumpur, you may saw this a tower the second tallest tower currently in the world is called Madeka 118 so I rewrite the sentence again so this building was built So built past tense completely so in October two thousand twenty one. So it is the tallest building in Malaysia
and it is located in Kuala Lumpur. Located in KL or Kuala Lumpur. So we write it in full form. So Kuala Lumpur. So the capital city of Malaysia. And then next, the building's name is called the building's name is called double L E D Badeka one one eight. And it has 118 stories. It has, so as the name implies, so it has one one, 118 stories. So that's it for today. So we are on this year five English plus one book book. We are on page 12. So if you're okay, you can subscribe here and then you can watch the related contents here. And then right below this video, you can click the link to join my diagram robot if you wish to.